Floor Meridian over here. Anybody know what state we're in? I'll tell you what state we're in. This is the land of make believe. See, I can go ahead and do this. Yes, Olive Garden breadsticks. That's right. There's a pumpkin patch over there. I don't know why I got distracted by that. Pumpkin season's actually coming up right now. Look at this. Dude, it's almost fall. Super excited. Fall, I'm glad that uh, summer's almost over, honestly, dude. It's been so hot lately. Today was another scorcher. Kimberly says happy birthday, Rishi. Thank you, Kimberly. I appreciate that. And Ron is again there dropping you guys. Five. Ron, thank you, man. All right, rock and roll, who's your go? Matt Hardcore and hashtag Ron. The road is Ray Hard Thing, LOL. <laughs> it's the great hard thing right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was all over the Ron, I believe that you said that. Did you, st did you start a new job over there, Ron? Big old tan force, swipe down your notifications. Sorry, I don't have any fun animations for that yet. But uh, I'll go ahead and work on that uh, probably tomorrow when I go home. Pumpkin spice latte. Gordy McGregor. Gordy McGregor. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about latte. But pumpkin spice coffee is my is my SHIT over there. Brittany says thank you for the gifted over there. Big old tan for Ron and Ken in the gym. Oh, dude, we're starting to hit a wild road over here. I was waiting for it. I'm like, this cannot be easy forever, guys. It can't be easy forever. There's going to have to be something that's wild over here. And this is definitely going to go ahead and get wild. Big old tan for Look at you guys swipe it down. Yeah, this is happy birthday, Richard. Thank you, Aaron. I appreciate that. It's the land of the fairies and giants and angry spiders over there. It'd be cool to have a big old... What was that? It would be cool to have, like, a big old, like, dragonfly fly into, like, over here and knock the trailer over and stuff like that. That would be pretty dope. This looks pretty cool. Like you delivered I'm liking this. Stars. It's so hot and smoky in southern Oregon that the kiddos had to have indoor recess on the second day of school. Huh. That's insane. What was the temperature out there in Oregon? I, I mean, I know that you're up there pretty high, but, uh... I know Russell was showing me like 113 degrees. I didn't think it got that hot out there in Oregon because it's right by Washington and they really don't get too hot over there. I didn't, I didn't really know. We have not been over 100 degrees over here in Pennsylvania. The highest was I think 90, 92 maybe. That's it. But humidity is what kills you over here. My dehumidifiers in my basement were full twice today. Once in the morning and once in the evening over here. All right, Matthew says, hey, Richard, how was your day today? It was well, brother. It was well. It's my birthday, so I can't complain. I was 21 years old today. I went out, got my first beer. Ron Shaw delivered Super exciting. Stars. Happy birthday to Rich <laughs> Thank Ron you, Ron. buddy. I appreciate that. Make sure you guys are swiping out on your notifications over there. Yeah, guys, 21 years old, got my first beer over there. Got rowdy, got carded, you know what I mean? Douglas Lane says, pass him. You think I should? You think I should be? You think I should pass him? Let's see if we could, guys. We've got 65 mile an hour right here. Let's see how fast this truck can go ahead and roll. Here we go. Frank Stone needs some air horn over there. All right, there's a little air horn action. Hopefully I don't hit him. Okay, I think I might have scared him a little bit. I didn't hit him though, I scared him. What's the company that you're driving for? Ozark, I've seen them before. I believe they're out of Tennessee. Does it say anywhere on the trailer, guys? Oh man, you're gonna make me crash over here. Oh yeah, right there, Nashville, Tennessee, dude. Ozark out of Nashville, Tennessee. Isaiah says, what's up, Ristream? Happy birthday. Thank you, Isaiah. Appreciate that. Josh Bullen's in the chat there. James Ford with the birthday wishes. And Douglas Lane's get her done. We're going to flip. We're going to flip. Back her down. Pop inside the truck here. I usually don't do those external views. Usually I'm in the truck the whole entire time. But this road is just so wild that I want to make sure that I'm not off-tracking anybody. Not like I care about shacks and stuff. Is there a town or highway there? There should be a drop-off location somewhere. Somewhere there should be a drop-off location. We're going somewhere, guys. Here, let me pull this up in the map. Uh, apparently not. Uh, I don't know why it's not red. I have no friggin' idea where we're going. Let's see. At the, look at the top of your screen. I'll, I'll go ahead and read it one second. Let me thank Mr. Anthony Hyde over there for the bombski. Thank you, Anthony. I appreciate that bombski. Thanks for all the support today, guys. Thanks for all the happy birthdays. Thanks for all the reactions on the stream. If you didn't drop a like on the stream, make sure you do drop a like. We're going to drop it here and disappear. Not like I'm using my shifter today. And the reason why is if you're just coming in right now, I'll go ahead and say it again. This road is just too wild to use the shifter, guys. I, I wouldn't be able to control it. And I'd probably break the thing by shifting so much. Miguel, uh, Mc, oh, Mc, McDad Darwilla over there. Hello, welcome to the stream, welcome to the party. Hopefully you're well. I don't think I've ever seen you before. Hello, hello, hello. What state is this, Nikki? Nikki, this is Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Just kidding. Uh, no, this is just a, a land of make-believe. There's actually no 
This is no state. This is just a made-up map. Just to, just to make fun and uh, make difficult roads. It's called the most impossible roads. It's actually not called that. I forget what it's actually called, but I, that's what I call it. Today, on my work, I pass an eight-car pileup with major injuries on it, says Ron Shaw. Very scary. I'm going to tell you a story. Story time! Hold on. Story time. Guess who was in my area today? Out of all the days. Well, not today, but yesterday. Technically, on the East Coast. If you're on the West Coast or in the middle of the United States, then today. Out of all the days when I wanted to go ahead and, you know, go about 40 miles away to a, a good restaurant. Who was in my area? Does anybody know? Anybody else from Pennsylvania in the chat? Does anybody else from Pennsylvania in the chat know who was in my area today? Bill Flynn says, I wish Philly looked like this. Niden? I, you were close on that one. Not Niden, but it starts with a B. <laughs> if was PA, all deliveries would be on time. All deliveries would be flipped over if this was a, a real road over here. I'm kind of glad. I did get rid of all the traffic, guys. At the beginning of the stream, we did have a crap load of traffic. Yeah, the president, guys. The president was in my area today out of all the times. So I believe he landed at our airport at 2 o'clock, and he was supposed to go ahead and come back at 6. Whenever he comes to the area, Trump or Biden or whatever president is elected at the time, they shut the whole entire highway down. So, I think it was 15 miles to the exit. It took about 95 minutes. 95 minutes stuck in traffic. Unreal. Uh, Eric Gibson redeeming the Mustang over there. Uh, Eric Jennings says Mr. Fox was in the area. No. Cheryl Fox wasn't over here. Something a little bit bigger than that. <laughs> yeah, you're right, guys. It was President Biden. Uh, Norm uh, with Biden over there. We got you. Brittany says I'm in. I'm from Pennsylvania, but I live in Wisconsin. How did you end up in Wisconsin? That's my question. I'd love to know how you ended up in Wisconsin out of all the states. I'd like to move south if I was going to move somewhere. South, maybe North Carolina, South Carolina. Really good living out there in North Carolina, South Carolina. Very reasonable price houses and stuff like that. You mean, oh, sleep. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to talk politics over here, guys, because we don't talk politics on the stream. But that was funny. All right, Ron Shaw says we're going to be late for class. Let's Josh Watson the chat there. Douglas Lane says, I want a die cast. Well, Douglas, did you put your explanation point here in the chat? And I do see you got a badge over there. So if you do come in on Friday and Saturday, we'll go ahead and give you some points when we spin the wheel or whatever we're going to do. I don't know. I'll probably throw something else together. You know me, I always I always got these good ideas. Uh, I'm in South Carolina, says Bill. I know that, Bill. Bill actually gave two NASCAR tickets to Amy on our giveaway. It was very, very nice. And I believe that's going on on September 4th, right? If I'm not wrong. I think I have a good memory on that. Take break. September 4th, NASCAR in South Carolina. Oh, this is pretty cool. Back her down. Back her down, back her down, back her down. We're gonna crash, we're gonna crash. Dude, I was just shacked it free for how long? And I tried to go ahead and do something stupid like that. Uh, 195 miles ago. Is that what it says? Okay, I wasn't really paying attention to what it said over there. I had to do something stupid like that. Absolutely friggin' insane in the membrane. I'm a knucklehead. All right, guys, let's get rolling again. Dude, I haven't had a shack today in like 10, 15 minutes. Uh, Derek wants a die-cast car as well. Everybody wants a die-cast car. I want one, too. I want one, too. Who wants to send me a die-cast car? <laughs> no, I have a bunch of them. I'll be sending out the packages this Friday. So if you guys redeemed anything from me in the last two weeks, We'll go ahead and do that. And I'll take a picture of it so you guys can see me doing it. I go upstairs, I get my laptop out, and uh, I put the stickers on all the cards for you guys, put them in the mailers, print out all the labels. It takes me forever. About four hours. CEO of Swift, smile with porn, 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 smile with porn. Big old tan for it. Doesn't uh, matter if you hammer down. Yeah, Shaq's doing Stoke Town today. We were trying to go ahead and, and uh, get up to 100, but I think I'm going to go ahead and keep it probably about 20 or 30 by the end of the stream over here. I want to do another load over here, but we're still 100 and some miles out, you guys said. I'm going to see where it says that at. Oh, we're 13 miles out, actually, guys. Top of your screen, the uh, lettering all the way over to the right says we're 13 miles out, 52 minutes away. I don't know if these are realistic miles or not, because this load was only 50 miles at the beginning of the stream. Let's go ahead and see if this is a realistic mile. Let's see if it takes one minute exactly for that to go ahead and go down. I believe they are realistic miles. So technically, this is going to probably take us about 12 minutes if I go 60 miles an hour. Yep, 
These are realistic miles over here. This is actually pretty cool. Some maps are one to one scale ratios, and this one actually is as well. See how it still says 12 up there? And I'm actually going 60 mile an hour. It's gonna take us a whole minute to do it. Okay, so 12 minutes it's gonna take us to get there. This is cool. They put a lot of uh, work into making this. Definitely got some side swipe out. Oh, we're flipping, dude. We're flipping. Yeah, we're flipping. I knew that was gonna happen. Knew it, called it. All right, let's go ahead and hop back up here. So 12 miles, hopefully I'm putting myself in the right direction over here. Are going the right way? Probably not. Probably not going the right way here, am I? Yeah, we're going the right way. Okay, only 11 miles left. Free walking. Sean says you're doing over 50 miles an hour. Well, I said 60. I said 60. Going 60 miles an hour uh, takes a mile a minute. Uh, let's see here. No, I'm 193 miles from St. Louis right now. All right, man. Uh, once you get to St. Louis, what do you have to do from there? Uh, Bill's taking a look at Eric his points Jenny over there. <laughs> I just want to go fast. Bill, I am 193 miles from St. Louis. And then what happens when you get to St. Louis over there? I was in St. Louis many, many a times. When I was uh, over the road, actually, I stopped at my very first, uh, I was going to say In-N-Out Burger, but not In-N-Out Burger. There's another burger place out there. Uh, steak and Shake. Steak and Shake. Never had it before. Always heard about it. Good milkshakes. All right burgers. Definitely In-N-Out had better burgers than that. Free walking's got 17,000 points over there. Shane Logan says, what map is this? This is the most dangerous roads, brother. The most dangerous roads. Pretty dope, huh? Uh, I don't know what it's actually called. It's in a different language. It's in, like, uh, Spanish. The, the modder actually is from Spain. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, I didn't understand. I didn't even know how to put the mod together because I couldn't understand anything it said. Uh, let's see here. This is on PC only. Thank you, Douglas Lane, for letting everybody know. Nathan Casey Westcott in the chat there. I kind of like these roads right here a little bit better. I know it's not as windy. The hills aren't as crazy, but it's definitely a little bit more relaxing than having the, what, what was it, like a, a 40% uh, grade? You have more wrecks than anyone. Where are the cops? There's no cops over here. There's no cops. There's no jurisdiction over here. Anything goes. And it's also the Autobahn as well, so there's no speed limit. I have not seen one speed limit sign here. Oh my god! Another shacks in it over there. I was looking for my animations. I don't have any shacks in animations over here. How am? I've definitely seen a lot of them in my area. They're usually down in Jersey. I don't know where they're out of, but... Kawan, Kawan, Kawan. I see a lot of them down in Jersey. Are they out of Jersey? Does anybody know where Kawan's out of? I don't have time to go out and look. Yep, see, I told you guys we're stuck on the hill. We can't get up the hill. Very, very slowly. All right, we don't have time for that. That's a 500 horsepower engine. Next time I play this, if I ever play this map again. Definitely will be a late night stream, I'll tell you that. Got a coal in hand. Uh, that's a mountain you're climbing. Yeah, that's a huge mountain we're climbing, dude. Huge mountain. I think you're enjoying the automatic. I am enjoying the automatic. I am enjoying it. It's definitely relaxing. I, I can't even imagine if I did use the shifter over here. Can't even imagine what it would be like. Uh, Calvin says happy birthday. Thank you, Calvin. I appreciate that. Have you ever been to Whataburger? I have never been to Whataburger. So I lived out in Tucson, Arizona for a while, and there was a Whataburger literally right on the main drag, right uh, right by my house. And uh, I always wanted Aaron to try Jennings it. Jennings delivered 100 stars. Going to bed, got to be right. at work at 6 a.m. I just crossed over to Missouri side now. Oh, okay. All right, brother. Big old Tanford, thanks for coming in. And thanks for the birthday wishes. Tomorrow, keep the shiny side up the dirty side down, okay, man? Thanks for coming in, my dude. All right, we're going to get around these guys. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to turn traffic down again, guys. There's no way I'm going to get up this hill if there's traffic. That's the problem. I can't move if there's traffic. I'm going to turn the traffic off again. Fortunately, I can't permanently turn it off. I have to kind of just do it in spurts over here. I think turn it off here. Hold on a second. Usually I could do that while I'm driving, but not today. I don't know. Uh, Chad White says, hello, Richard. Hello, Chad. Nice to see you. Scotty says, it's good. You should try it. Oh, yeah. So anyway, there was one right around there. And I always said to myself I wanted to try it. But uh, once I tried Wiener Schnitzel, I just got addicted to that. I would eat that like at least once a week. Uh, 1,000 horsepower engine for those hills. Yeah, I'm going to need something stronger. I thought 500 would do it. 500 is definitely not going to cut it out. 
Uh, Craigstone says you're a cheater. Well, what do you expect me to do, dude? I, I, I don't, I'm not gonna be able to get up the hill without a record. There's no way I'm getting up there. Even if I lock my diffs and I already tried it at the beginning of the stream, there's no way I'm gonna get up there, so. I kinda just have to keep cheating. Now I got some momentum on this hill. So I could definitely get up here. See that? I got it. But when there's cars around, then I can't do it. If I don't have the momentum. Watch out, Ashley Furniture. You gotta roll the filter loser. Shorty, great from Heather. Thank you, Shorty. Thank you, thank you, Shorty. Watch my off track. Oh, Jackson. Remember when COVID first hit and everything was closed? Roads yeah. were empty. Yeah, that's what you need on this map. Yeah, I know. Yeah. This looks like just a one lane. La, la, save, save it. Oh! oh! Just when you think that you're getting somewhere, guys. Just when I thought that I saved it, I totally failed on that one. All right. What's your favorite steak joint in, uh, in Philadelphia? Well, I've never had Pat's and Gino's before. They're right across the street from each other, but I did have Tony Luke's. Tony Luke's is probably my favorite cheesesteak. The good thing about the cheesesteaks is not the meat or the cheese. I know uh, Pat's and Gino's over there are all about the cheese. One uses uh, Cheese Whiz, the other one uses, I think, American cheese. It's all about the bun. The bun comes from the dirty Susquehanna River, dude. Delivered one no, I am driving back to St. Louis from my uncle's funeral lawn. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, you're just coming back today on a Tuesday. Okay, the funeral was, I remember you told me it was going to be on Monday. So you stayed out there, and then you're coming back. Okay, cool, okay, copy that, Eric. Okay, I was wondering what you're doing, because I know that you run a, uh, a transport bus over there. Wasn't too sure. I didn't want to question you too much on that one. But now, that all makes sense, yeah. My, my condolences over there. Hopefully, you're able to go ahead and run into some family members that you haven't seen in a while. Uh, Donald Marcus Howard says, can you see my comments? Yes, I can see your comments over there, Donald. Uh, Chad in the chat there. Chad, your stream was awesome tonight, man. Thanks for letting me come in there and say hello. He was, uh, running a firefighter over there. Scotty says Chipotle is another good place to eat. Yeah, Chipotle is a great place to eat. Just, uh, you know what I mean? You might get a little stomach ache later, you know what I mean? I haven't been to Chipotle in quite a long time. I like Jersey Mike's. Uh, New York has the best cheesesteaks. That's a lie. Philadelphia has the best cheesesteaks. All right, we're going to come down here. Back or down? If the bun doesn't come from the dirty Susquehanna River, which Susquehanna does go up to uh, New York. What is going on here? That looks like a geyser or something like that. Coming out of the road. Someone needs to fix the potholes in the road over here. Hit some more potholes. Let's see what happens. Holy mole. Look at the potholes over here. Boy. Yeehaw, brother. Oh, what happens when I don't pay attention? I'm all over the road. Keep it rolling, Rishi. Keep it on the road. Uh, yes, cheese whiz. No, thank you. Yeah, I'm not a cheese whiz kind of guy. I, I think I had cheese whiz with when I was a young kid. I used to put them on like rich crackers. That's about it. I, I, I don't know. Maybe it would be good on a cheesesteak. I, I can't really knock it till I try it, man. That was a freaking guy in a hot dog suit right there. Dude, it's getting, it's getting late. I'm, I'm starting to see stuff up here. I was seeing spiders, now I'm seeing guys in hot dog suits walking around. You're always welcome to join my man. Yep, absolutely, man. Thank you. I'm glad you got, I'm glad you got it squared away as well. Scotty says you're about right on that. I'm going to crash. Going off the side on that one. Oopsie doopsies, another accident. We might actually go over 30. I told you guys 30, but we actually might go over that. All right, let's see what happens on this one. Kind of stuck on that uh, PT Cruiser right there. Actually, that's not a PT Cruiser. That's one of those uh, Mini Coopers. Giant spiders, volcanoes. Heck yeah, brother. And and guys in hot dog outfits as well. Can't be good on suspension. No. And I always run. Hold on a second. What's that noise? No, that's the Jake break. Right? Well, of course I can't hear it right now. Anyway, I hear like birds chirping. Listen. Does anybody else hear that? Well, I did. Now I don't hear anyone. There was like birds chirping. Oh, I'm not getting up this hill. No friggin' way we're getting up this. No way. Look at us drop our RPMs. No way we're getting up there. We're dead in the water. Yeah, those are birds chirping. It's not that early in the morning right now, is it? It's 12.52 and the birds are out? No way. Birds come out around uh, 4.30, 5 o'clock. When you get up, guys, that's usually when I hear the birds chirping. Some people have uh, chickens in their yard or roosters. We just have birds over here. Uh, what do you 
only stream two games? Uh, no, I have a bunch of other. We sometimes we stream uh, Mud Runner and stuff. Not Mud Runner, Snow Runner. But we haven't been on there in a while. I've kind of been focusing on uh, updating my uh, LSPDFR, which is the Grand Theft Auto Cop game, and it takes a lot of hours. Like to put that New York City together that I did, it probably took about 12 hours to do. And I'm still not fully satisfied with it. As an endorsement for two months. So I'm still working on that. That's why I said coming soon, and that's why I didn't go live with it. Just because it's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. And hopefully it, it, it does get ready, because if not, then that was a waste of time. Uh, let's see here. Da, 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 da. Yes, this is, this is my favorite game right here. This is my favorite game. Uh, the cop game, definitely number two. But I started out playing this game. This is my favorite game out of every game ever. Even on Xbox, PlayStation, anywhere. Uh, Adam saying thank you to Ken. Big old Ken for. Ken, if you're still up, uh, Adam says thank you. I know it is getting a little late up here. I don't expect you guys to stay for the whole entire stream. I just wanted to come on and say hello. How you doing? What in the world is that? Oh, my God. 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 There's a spider right there. Wait a minute. 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 J.B. Hunt was exempt from the spiders, but I wasn't. The spiders are all after me today. Oh, they're spawning right there, so I'm going to have to come over here to the left. This is wild. I'm not going to be able to get around them, am I? There's so many. <laughs> dude, that's insane. Come on, dude. Move out of my way. Break the spider over here. Move it. Come on, dude. This is insane. What's up, Kamo? Kamo Pickering in the chat saying hello to us. Kamo, how you doing, my man? Hopefully you are well. All right, guys, we're gonna come up here just a little bit. Dude, there goes the spiders again. I was waiting for them. I knew they were gonna come back. Oh, uh, what part, what kind of spiders do they have in Spain? I don't know. I don't know, but I know in, uh, was it Australia? They have spiders that are bigger than your hand. I've seen uh, like pictures of it on the internet before. There's spiders bigger than your hand. When I lived out in Arizona, they had tarantulas. I saw my first tarantula when I was installing security webcam in a nursing home. And I captured it and I put it in a jar. And then I went outside and I grabbed a small scorpion. And I saw, I, try, I tried to see if they were gonna fight each other. They never ended up fighting each other. It's kind of boring. I sat there for like 10 minutes watching them. I'm like, come on, one of you guys kill each other. And nothing ever happened to them. Those spiders look like tarantulas. They do look like huge tarantulas. It looks like the rocks slowly coming down the hill. Very, very slow. <laughs> How is it rolling so many times, but yet going so slow? Oh my god. This truck's going right to the junkyard when we get to the yard. Right to the junkyard. It's all... There's no way this thing would, would ever keep going on a road like this. Ever. Look at that. That's insane. We'd have a tie rod definitely broken. Uh, Mickey's got the clip. Dallas Joyce got the clip over there. You saw that. You saw that, right? You saw that rock going down the hill. That was a little nuts. Uh, happy birthday, Ristream, says Tyler Howard. Tyler, thank you, man. Good stuff. This is, this is just, this is too much. This is too much. They didn't need to go this crazy right here. Maybe, Ristream, you didn't need to go too crazy by putting a low... Uh, bumper on your truck. Yeah, I should have thought about that before I made my truck. I don't know if you guys could see Crete back there, but Crete's bouncing around as well. Look at Crete. He's jumping around like crazy too. All right, let's see what happens up here. Josh Poland's got his uh, 72 days of followers. Thank you, Josh. Scotty says, looks like Lisa Kelly. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. On Ice Road Truckers. Oh my goodness, look at the bus over there too. We're stuck. We're not getting over that rock, are we? Maybe. Yeah, well, let's back up a little bit. Let's put our dip block on. Let's try that. All right, let's take the dip block off. Nope. All right, let's leave it on. Kind of stuck back there. There we go. Yeah, what a fall. Look at that. Rock and roll, Hoochie Coo. Here we go. <laughs> That's just a little insane, guys the first time we've ever tried this, so bear with me. Uh, Chad White over there with the 283 days. Clayton says, what in the actual F is going on? No idea, brother. No idea. 
when I get to the shop, I'll tell you exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm definitely gonna take this friggin' bumper off the front of the truck. And number two, oh, you know what? I can't, I can't put a more uh, powerful engine in this until tomorrow because I have to go ahead and put a different mod in there for that. So, if we ever play this again at night, we can flip over. Then we'll have to go ahead and put like a thousand or a, a ten thousand horsepower engine in this. Uh, James says, "Looks like some of our roads in California." There goes a. Anybody know what that's called? It's called a crop duster, isn't it? I'm sure, some of you guys know about crop dusting, huh? James says, uh, "Hey, Ristream, hope we had a great day." This is James Elliott. Uh, James, I had a fantastic day, brother. Uh, David Hartman over there with this. How many got? 300. Hey, it's a whole year today. 365. Alligator. Alligator or crocodile? Which one's bigger, guys? I don't remember that from high school. Which one's bigger, an alligator or a crocodile? I think a crocodile, right? Uh, Bill's got the 400. Oh, 405 over there. Jordy with exactly 365 today. Uh, spraying the uh, mosquitoes, I guess. No, they're spraying those spiders. Those wild spiders. <laughs> They're spraying Terminex. Or, or what is that stuff? Yeah, Terminex? What's the spider killer called? Come on! I did put the biggest tires uh, available on the drives. I thought that might help a little bit, but... Nope, ain't gonna happen. We're just, we're just struggle festing 5,000 out okay. uh, David says a crocodile is bigger. Alright. Crocking! Uh, heck yeah, I finally got my one year. Yes, one year of follows. That's awesome, dude. I'll have to remember that. I know uh, Karen Carroll got hers. Heather got hers. Bill's got his. I've got a raid, dude. No, we don't have a raid. Thank you. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and go up here. That road's just too insane right there. Let's just, uh, let's cheat a little bit. We're almost there. I'm three miles away. Three real miles in real life. That. Of something from uh, Mario. What is that? We're going into the roads out here that are like Australian roads. Oh, there's a croc. Whoa! <laughs> That's crazy, dude. That's crazy cool, too. Alright, let's keep it going. Keep it going, Ristry. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Uh, but Russell says, welcome to the jungle. All right, I should be playing some uh, Guns N' Roses over here. Got the stream on my 40-inch right now. It might not look good on your 40-inch because I do have a crop for mobile on, on this one. I figured since we'd be goofing around, we might as well put it in mobile view. Uh, Bill Cook's got the 11 months out there. One more month for a year of supporters from Bill. Big old camp for Bill. Brittany says, happy birthday again. I have to work tomorrow due to our district manager visit tomorrow. So it's going to be a stressful day. All right. Well, thanks for definitely coming in, Brittany. I appreciate that. And thanks for the two or three birthday wishes that you did give me today. Crop duster. All right. Dude, I'm getting aggravated with these rocks. Like, they can do away with the rocks. They can do away with this part. This is, this is just getting a little annoying. Like, the spiders are cool. The alligators are cool. The rocks, not so much. No, we're stuck with them. Put our diff lock in. We'll see if I get over this. I doubt it. Nah, not gonna happen. Cheat, dude. If I didn't have this cheat thing on here, dude, we would be um, we'd be live for like three minutes. I'd be like, okay, stream's over. Have a, everybody have a good night. Uh, Heather's over in the chat there. What does she got? Thirteen months, Heather. Big old tan for on that. Brayden Tierney got his point for the stream. Brayden, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the party. I already asked you guys, but I'm guessing that my microphone sounds good. I feel like this truck's just a little too loud. Oh, this is this is just stupid. This is just a stupid part right here. Come on. It's that bumper. Come on. Alright, let's cheat a little bit here. I gotta I gotta get that bumper out there. We're not gonna ever make it through there. We need like a uh, a monster truck to come through here. Grave digger. Uh, let's see here. Uh, do you ever follow a Friday, says Jeremy Packer. Follower Friday, we do uh, giveaways on Fridays and Saturdays. Uh, Scott, Don, yay, hey, Don. Don, I was waiting for you to go ahead and come in. Good stuff, Don. Don, hopefully you're feeling better. Don just went through surgery. Hopefully you're feeling a little bit better. Don's coming in from Perth, Australia. 
I know it's daytime out there. Dawn right now, over here on the East Coast. It was my birthday yesterday, Dawn, so that's why I'm live a little late over here. Uh, it is 1 o'clock in the morning. Jeremy says 5 mile an hour down that road. Jeremy, I can't even get over those bumps with this, uh, with the bumper on this truck, so that's why I'm cheating. We're 3 miles out still. Come on, dude, I gotta get around this guy. Gabrielle Van Lines over here, which is the moving company. Never gonna make it around him on that corner, though. Never gonna be able to make it around that corner. Come on, dude. There we go. I'm not gonna be able to pass him. Not on this road. Uh, fertilizing the devil's lettuce. I have not seen any devil, devil's lettuce in the game yet. I'm sure there probably will be some over here for you guys. Oh, he crashed. All right, now we have to get around him. He's, oh, I'm not going. I'm not, I'm not gonna be able to make it up that road. Nope, not gonna happen. Looks like there's some mud right there. Not gonna do that. Not gonna do that. Not gonna do that. Too difficult. All right, let's put ourselves right here. I want to see some of those spiders. Uh, yeah, red. Yeah, yeah. We're not gonna be in tomorrow. Uh, I got my money from Knuckleheads to back today. I got my money from the Knuckleheads or took all of it back today. My money. What do you mean by that, Sean? What do you mean by that? I go in for surgery next month. Christina Boyer, I didn't even know you were going into surgery. What, what happened to you over there? This stream is equivalent to the example of how creative and intelligent a human can be. Thank you for providing. Hey, Calvin, thank you, brother. I appreciate that. This is definitely not as creative we can get over here. We definitely got some other stuff that's pretty cool. This is just uh, kind of me goofing around on my uh, after birthday hours over here. But thank you for that positive compliment, man. I appreciate that. Very, very nice of you to say. All right, let's go ahead and hop back inside for a little bit. We'll go ahead and enjoy the... Uh, we're not going to enjoy Sarah. Josh, I just saw Josh back there, guys. Josh was actually fishing. Josh! Josh, Josh, Josh. There's Josh or Ryan McKee. He's got his fishing pole, and I do got some fishing poles inside the truck as well. I don't think he's going to catch anything, dude. He's casting up river over here. <laughs> I don't think you're going to catch anything over there, brother. You should be throwing it the other way. All right, let's go. Got things to do, people to see. I get easily distracted. I do apologize about that. The stupidest stuff uh, distracts me up here. That's why people always say, oh, look, squirrel. I can definitely hear birds. Either there's birds in this game, or I got a mouse in my house over here or something. If I have a mouse, there's gonna, there's gonna be a problem. I've never had a mouse in my house before. And I've never had a bat in my house before either. My neighbor had two of them. She just had one uh, last week, apparently. I'm like, how do you get them? I guess her air conditioners have a big gap in them. I'm gonna put like a towel there, a piece of cardboard. All right, let's keep it rolling. Uh, Norm says, hey, wrist stream, I'm just about to head to bed. You guys have a great night, birthday man. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. Appreciate the positive vibes, dude. Gordon Armado claiming his point over there. And Philip Morgan says, it's birds. Okay, good. 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 Yeah, they're loud, too. I'm just not happy with this portion of the road, not going to lie. I don't know what that is. You never seen the movie Tremors before? Reminds me of when the tremor's underground and kind of leaves that uh, dirt pile like that. I haven't seen that movie in so long. I used to watch every single one of them almost every weekend when I was a kid. I don't know why I loved it so much. Tremors. I haven't seen it probably about 20 years. Oh yeah, there's definitely birds over here. We're gonna cheat. Hashtag wrist stream cheater. Uh, Braden Tierney. Uh, Lasher says better than a bat in the house. Trust me, I know a lot of experience. You've had a bat in your house before? Never had a bat in the house. Never had a bad house. Knock on wood. Knock on wood. But I'm pretty good at uh, making sure that there's no uh, gaps or anything that go on the outside. Just freaking hate bugs and crap. You know what I mean? All right. Uh, Josh says, I love Tremors too. I can't remember. There was so many of them. Either one of the first two are the best ones though. They end up coming out with a, a bunch of them. I don't remember how many there were. All right. We're not going to make it up that hill either. Keep it rolling, Archie. Keep it rolling. Come on, we're almost there, guys. I literally got one mile. One realistic mile, that is. My favorite movie, Grow Enough, they have them on Netflix. Oh, do they? Maybe one of these days I'll have to throw myself back at it. <laughs> think about the old times when I was 12, 13 years old. Uh, I think I watched all the Tremors. Hold on. I need a drink. Can't talk over here, guys. Lose my voice. 
losing my voice. Talking all day today. Not in the stream, but in real life. Um, you have damage turned off. Oh, yeah, absolutely. If I had damage turned on, we wouldn't have made it five minutes into the stream. What the frick is going on here? Which way do I go? This way? Oh, there's a car coming, too. Good. Move it. Move it. Can I get around him, you think? I'm gonna have to run that construction worker over. Sorry, dude. Sorry, buddy. We gotta get around you, though. We got things to do, people to see. Alright, here we go. Beautiful. Let's get back out on the road here. Awesome. Uh, Tremors 1 was the best. Uh, guys, I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. I watched them all, but I don't remember one between two and what, what the difference was. So many years ago. Uh, gonna roll out, says Red. Alright, Red. Have a great night, man. Definitely know it's getting late for a lot of you guys over there. Hey, speaking of Red Bull. Speaking of Red Bull, I know I shouldn't be drinking one right now in the middle of the night. Probably not gonna be able to fall asleep. But hey, it is what it is. Who wants to watch LSPDFR after this stream? I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Total of... Oh, there were seven of them. Holy moly. Alright, we're gonna hit this uh, pothole road here. Oh, uh-oh. There's a spider right there. Now, I don't know where he's gonna spawn from. Probably behind us. Gotta be careful here. I literally just saw him going up the road. Did anybody else see the spider? Okay, good. He's long gone. He's not gonna go ahead and hurt me. Got pushed off the road by every spider that we've seen so far. Uh, I do. I do, says Russell Brock. Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, there's seven Trevor's movie. Thank you guys for letting me know. I appreciate that. And Red, thanks for the GG's, man. Have yourself a fantastic night. Def definitely thanks for coming in. Thanks for having birthday wishes as well. There was just a Walgreens truck back there hauling some, uh, some tubes. Jordan says, uh, I didn't know you were alive for a stream. Been crazy with everything going on. Yeah, you know what? I am live right now, dude. I'm going to watch my off track here. I am live. But, dude, do what you got to do, man. You don't have to be present for all my streams. Right. I, know, I know that you got things going on. Definitely appreciate you making some time coming in. All right, let's look at our map. Making a right-hand turn right here. Back or down? Turn right. We're in Marie Luz Sanchez. What's up, Sarah? looking at over there? Sarah's staring at me. She's looking for Ryan. Uh, Kevin Bacon and Fred Ward. Kevin Bacon, dude. Kevin Bacon. Oh, dude, he was in, uh... He played the, uh, protagonist in I don't know. Uh, let's see here. Dominic in the chat there. Jessica. David over there with Papa. Okay, turn right. Beach, Elliot. Cool beans, dude. All right, where are we turning then? Oh, we're here. We're delivering. Nice. Cool in turn here. right. Can I back in? Can I back in from the road? Nah, we don't need to back in. Big part. Watch our off track. Beautiful. All right, let's find our spot. According to the map, it's right there. It should be right here. Yep, there it is. Easy peasy, Japanesey. We'll do a blind side. Do a blind side. I'm gonna go ahead and whack her in there on the first shot. I don't know how this is gonna work out because I'm an automatic. Usually I uh, I inch the clutch when I'm backing up. But this time you gotta leave it in automatic and it kinda sucks, so we're gonna try this out. My first back ever in automatic. And, and what, wrist trade? And he nails it, dude. And he nails it. Happy birthday and GG's, RADs in the chat there for a perfect back. Hop inside. Go ahead and pull the brakes out. Shut the engine down. We'll go ahead and get ourselves live unloaded. We don't have a. We're gonna release our brakes here. And we're gonna go ahead and pull out. We're gonna find our spot. Let's look at the map. Come out of here, make a left, and then immediately go ahead and make a right. I'm over here reaching for my shifter. The first time I did that. First time I did that today. Turn left. Kind of habitual for me to uh, do. Uh, you need it. Uh, yeah, let me see here, actually. Oh, there's a garage over here. I'm going to go ahead and take that bumper off. Yeah, I'm going to take that bumper off. Hopefully, I can just take Turn everything right. off. But I can't put the 1,000 horsepower engine because I don't have one. Yeah, I don't have Turn a mod right. in there for that right now. So that'll have to wait till a, uh, till a next stream. The garage right around the corner right here. This 
definitely looks like Mexico. Where is it? Like right there. All right, we're gonna get around these guys. They're already causing accidents up here. Here, dude. Okay, there it is. Beautiful. Pull in here. Honk the horn. Open up. Uh, Kevin Bacon played in Footloose. Hello. A uh, few good men. Uh, oh yeah, that was what it is. The Sleepers. The Sleepers one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it was. I have not seen most of those movies that you just made over there. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. Yo, this is dope. Old school truck ramp over here. Change the oil out. Work underneath the truck. I have not ever seen one of these in real life before. I've never seen one. Not ever seen one such Make a big turn. Pick and roll. 135 stars. That Boston, you got race miles on that run. Oh, I... Wait, what? Oh, you want to know why? Because there was a hill at the beginning of the stream, and I couldn't get up it, so I hammered down to try to go ahead and get up the hill. That's probably what gave it to me, because I don't know when else I got race miles on that run. I, I wonder what it would have gave me. How many miles would it have gave you? Only 50 miles, right? Because this is a one-to-one -one ratio map. So it actually goes realistic. We started with a 50 mile trip. All right, guys, hold up a second. We gotta do something here. We gotta go ahead and take the, um... oh, shoot. We got to uh, take the bumper off here, unfortunately. Uh, can I take it all the way off? Uh, that's as small as I can make it. As small as I can make it. Let's get that plastic up. They're both the same. I like the chrome better. We'll do chrome. We'll do chrome and we'll get our oil changed over here as well. It's fired up. Make a U turn. Pick and roll. We'll go ahead and roll our windows down here. Let's go ahead and roll them nice and low. Why do you roll down the windows, Restream? Because the engine is louder when the windows are down. That's why. Right. Fire it up. Engine's on. We're going to go ahead and release our brakes. Were they already released? They were. I was sitting there in neutral. Knucklehead. All right, where are we going? Over here to the right. Uh, what are you doing on your birthday, Restream? My birthday's over, bro. My birthday's over. Yeah, my birthday was uh, yesterday. <laughs> yeah. The reason why people are saying happy birthday is because look at that guy taking pictures. Is uh bu -bu 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 -bu. why? Why were they? I don't know. They were freaking out. Turn left. No, uh, because I tried to come on at 11:59 on the East Coast, and it's still technically my birthday in some states. Break on. We're gonna be picking up over here at Staples. There's our trailer. Oh, barbecue chicken alert! Barbecue chicken alert! I'm tired of talking. Turn Let's get our off. bills out here, guys. We'll go ahead and accept that load. Uh, oh, I can change the trailer. Ooh, fancy. What do you guys want me to run over here? Not going to do a 53, though, so it has to be a 48. Ooh, actually. Actually, I found something good for these back roads right here. <laughs> Take a look at these ones. All right. We got a green truck. Let's see if we can find a green trailer over here. Ah, there's only crappy ones. No doubles. All right. I don't want a curtain side, but if I have to do a curtain side, I guess I will. Because, obviously, FedEx in real life doesn't have curtain siders. What was that noise? There's no green ones. Here, let's do this one. Do that one. Whatever. That looks good. Let's do a small little baby one. Where's my small little baby trailer? Oh, there it is. Uh, Walter says Staples. Nah. Staples doesn't match my truck. I need something with green in it. We're stream, I have to fly. I gotta go ahead and get up early in the morning. Hey, dude, thanks for coming in. Definitely appreciate that. I know it's getting late, bro. I know it's getting late. I don't expect you guys to stay. But those of you guys that are still here, I'll go ahead and run one more. All right, we're gonna go ahead and attach All this. set for the playoffs on yeah. TNT? Ready. Let's go. Let's roll. <laughs> this looks silly. I have never pulled one of these in real life. Smallest one in real life was a 48. <laughs> That's hilarious. I lied. I lied. A 40. There was run, there was runs that used to go down to Brooklyn. That would that would only allow 40 foot Turn left. All right, where are we going here? Left. Oh, uh, happy late birthday, bro! Says Joe. Hey, dude, thank you for the birthday wishes. I appreciate that. Uh, windows down and hammer down. Party loud, says Toby Stroud. Thank you, bro. Appreciate that. We got our blinker. We're gonna go to make our turn. It's all yours when you want it. And yeah, the roads are not gonna stay like this. Once we get out of this city, they're gonna turn wild. I don't know what to expect because this uh, portion of the map is undiscovered. Uh, Drew Martinez says Walmart. Nah, we're doing this one. It says uh, America and Canada. Turn left. That kind of makes sense because we're in a land of make-believe over here, so we don't know where we're at. 
You got that American flag on the uh, truck as well. Play this happy birthday and good night. Good night, brother. Thanks for coming in after you got off your shift at work. I appreciate you spending some time. Ken Spranger over there with the GG. Thank you, Ken. Appreciate that, buddy. All right, here we go. All right, let's see if we find any spiders, tarantulas, or what we find out here. Joe, uh, Toby Strauss says turn quick. Yeah, these ones actually are harder to back up. The smaller the trailer, harder it is to back up. Fresh stream. How? Because of the, uh, the ratio. It's harder. Walter, Joe, uh, Ken, thanks for the big old finger and thanks for the GG. Ken, if you're not as well, thanks for coming in. He was here since the beginning of the stream. I remember seeing you. Fall night, says Drew Martinez. Oh my goodness gracious. Probably will have to if I'm drinking all this Red Bull over here. Uh, Melvin Beaver's got the GGs. Buddy. Alright. This is a little easier. A little easier with the tiny trailer. A little stubby here. Tuck on the hill. Pick it up. Pick it up. Epic fail. Nope, not gonna happen. We'll try it again. Wheels are spinning. Come on, baby. Come on. David O'Queen delivered 100 stars. Baby. Good night, got to get up brother. at 730, and it's already One of our first comments of the stream the over there. Keep it up. One of the first comments of the stream over there, David. Thank you, man. I appreciate you coming in saying hello. Have a good day at work. Probably see you tomorrow. Yeah, this isn't going to happen. That ain't going to work out. Trying to get ourselves up to the top of the hill here. Uh, Walter says it's like a toy, yeah, it's like a little toy truck, a little baby. Oh, there's a spider right there. There's the spiders. I, I think the spiders are hilarious. But the funny thing about them is, is the other trucks are um, um, invisible to them. Oh, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. All right, we're good, we're good. <laughs> uh, put a bloke on it. What's a bloke? Alexander, what's a bloke? Jake says I'm a cheater. Jake, I couldn't get it up there. We don't have time for that either. All right, we gotta hammer down on this hill. We're not gonna make it. No friggin' way. No friggin' way. What is that? Like a 50% grade right there? No way we're getting up there. I will try for you guys. I can't even stop, honestly. I can't even stop here. Cooler breakout. I'll put my dip lock on. I'll show you guys that it's not possible to get up this hill with only a 500 horsepower. Watch. Give her some fuel. We're gonna drop the brake. Oh, did I lie? No. Maybe, maybe we could. No. Okay. I was gonna say we couldn't do it before. We got the we got the diff lock on, so we got both axles spinning right now. Eric Crawley delivered 200 stars. Any shacks of it? Uh. Do you want me to lie or tell the truth? Do you want me to lie? No shacks in it, in my life. To be honest, yeah. Probably about 20 or 30 shacks in it. Lots of shacks in it. Blocks. Oh, blocks. Okay, you said blokes. Yeah, blokes is, I think, what Australians or Englanders call us Americans, right? Sorry, typo. Okay, okay. Wasn't sure. What the F was that thing, says Joe? That was a tarantula that got into uh, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids' uh, basement over there, and they made him extra large. What about the turning and steering back and forth? Yeah, it won't, it won't, it won't do it. They suggest that you use, uh, I think it's a 2,000 horsepower engine for this map, and I was stubborn, and I only put 500 horsepower. All right, let's hammer down. Let's hammer down. 20 or 30, the goal is 100. We're, we're Saved it. Saved it. Saved it. We're good. I'm kind of liking the color of the truck. We have not used a green truck like this in quite a long time. When I first started streaming over here, that's when I first always used the green. Always used white and green. Our buddy Jeff Arthy actually used to name the trucks for me, and one of them was White Lightning. Oh my god, dude! Ignorant. Ignorant, ignorant, ignorant. I still got my diff lock on. Let me try your uh, your back and forth thing. This isn't isn't as steep as the grade before though. 
working. It's working. It's working. Alright, you got it. That one was not as steep as the other one before. Hulk green. Yeah, Hulk green. Is the Hulk a little bit darker than that? Jordan Spencer with the tacos. Jordan, is it still Taco Tuesday for you over there? I figured out the last minute before I came live. I'm like, you know what? Let's throw the taco sticker in there. For those of you that still have uh, Tuesday going on. Chain up. Yeah, chain up. I wish it was a possibility. Chain says, Jeff. Jeff, they do have them in the game. But the dynamics of the game don't actually allow them to, to be used. Like, you can put them on there. They're just for show. They don't actually do anything inside the game. Kind of sucks. When you watch my winter stream, when winter comes around the corner here, you'll see me doing a lot of snow streams over here. And I'll put the chains on and stuff. You use your, man your maneuvering over here. Dude, it's in gear and I'm sliding down the hill. We're going in the ditch. Full break, full break! Try it. Try your... This is, this is like the green from before. Let's try it. Go, that works. I have not known about this for the last two and a half years. Work out. Oh, I don't have my camera on. <laughs> Dude, where'd my camera go? Why did anybody tell me my freaking camera wasn't on? Uh, can you remember the first day you started? I can't remember the first day. I remember about like the first month. But I don't remember the actual first day. I don't remember the first day. I know I was super nervous. Uh, Don says uh, Wednesday at 1.25 in the afternoon over here. Oh, so Don, you're exactly 12 hours ahead of me. You're exactly 12 hours ahead of me. Because over here it's 1.26 right now in, in, in the uh, AM. We're going to have to turn that off before we blow it. We're not supposed to go over 35 with a diff on. 25, 35. Uh... That's crazy. Well, now I'll know, Don, exactly what... I have never known that it was 12, 12 hours. Big old 10 for So when I'm doing my convoy streams at 10 o'clock at night on the weekends, I'll see you over there at 10 o'clock in the morning. Dude, uh, you can't you freaking imagine trying to actually drive a hill like that? No. No, I, I can't even imagine, dude. I mean, imagine, imagine the, uh, the truck in front of you able to go ahead and make it up. And then you stall on the hill or you miss a gear. I feel like such an idiot. I feel like such an idiot. Brayden Tierney says jackknife. Yeah, we had a jackknife before. <laughs> I even got a suspicious taco over here, says Elvis. <laughs> Do you really? Did you have tacos today? Uh, I was going to go to a taco uh, place for my birthday. But I'm a really picky eater. So tacos that are not made at your house, I'm pretty picky about. I don't like uh, guacamole. I don't like onions or tomatoes. So when you go to a Spanish, Mexican uh, taco place, usually everything has that crap all over it. And yeah, I don't eat that. Uh, Dustin Hacker, what a do, brother? Welcome to the stream, welcome to the party. How are you doing today, man? Nick says, I have got six o'clock in the morning in the United Kingdom. 6 a.m., yeah, you guys are five hours ahead of us. Yeah, you guys are five hours, I know that. Big old 10 well, good morning to you, Nick. 12 hour difference, says Don. Yep, 12 hour difference. 30 in California, you lucky duck. Karen Carroll, are you still in the chat? I know Karen was here when I first started my stream at midnight my time. It was only 9 o'clock her time. I'm sure she's sleeping though because her and Pedro, her husband, they get up at like 4 o'clock in the morning. Come on, baby. Oh, Betsy, you can do it. We got it. We got it. Nice. Want to hear a funny story, says Alexander, from what happened to me with tacos. Yeah, tell me the funny story, brother. Tell me the funny story while I struggle here. Let me try your, your method. After two years, if this works. Oh. Yep, that ain't working, dude. Let's go ahead and get our diff lock on. Pull the brakes, pull the brakes, pull the brakes! I'm sliding. Put the diff lock on. Pull the brakes back out. Try that again. Not gonna happen. You see our wheel spinning right there. Not gonna happen, dude. Alright, pull the brakes. Get our diff lock off. And we're gonna cheat. We're gonna have to cheat here just a little bit. Rich, how far out are you? We are 16 miles out. We've only went four miles so far. We've only went four miles. Uh, eight, uh, 928 in Anchorage, Alaska. 
9.28 p.m. in Anchorage, Alaska. Yeah, so you guys are on the same time zone. Oh, no. You're not on the same time zone as California. <laughs> yeah, because it's 10 o'clock in Cali. Alaska, fully 9 o'clock out there. Nice. Now, are you guys going through that 40 days of 40 night yet or no? When does that happen? I don't really know because that's on the other side of the country from me. I'm way on the other side. Uh, I'm going nowhere uphill. Yeah, anytime I hit a hill, basically it's not going to happen. Especially with the grades like that. Uh, wow, don't run off the road when you flip up. You're going to make me flip right here, dude. Yeah, the grades are just insane. Look at that. What goes up must come down. We were already on that portion of the road right there. Look, at even even Estes is all over the road. But he's pulling it up there like a bat out of H-E double hockey sticks. <laughs> Alaska, Hawaii are one hour behind the West Coast over there. Oh, okay. Big old can four. Well, now I know. I'm learning a lot today. Uh, when does the time change? Uh, well, th like I said, this is a one-to-one -one ratio. So the time will be realistic. So the time, sh uh, a minute in the game is a minute in real life. I think moving the steering wheel from side to side only works in sand, says Rick Beach. Okay. I honestly never even knew that before. I would have never thought to try that. I kind of thought that might have dug yourself a little deeper. Sand, no? If you're pushing the sand out, you're kind of falling deeper into the sand? That's what I would have thought. Uh, I could definitely be wrong. All right, let's get some momentum on the hill here. Can we do it? Yes, no, maybe so. I think we got it. All right, we got it, 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 we got it. Nice. Come on, Betsy. When that engine is high idling like that, guys, can you guys still hear what I'm saying? Because I feel like over here on my side, it's just super loud. Resting up, uh, the doctor said that I have to complete uh, a bed rest with strong painkillers. Okay. Well, you just had uh, surgery over there, major surgery on your stomach, so I could, I could imagine you definitely can pick heavy things up and uh, definitely some bed rest. How long do you have to do that for? Two, three weeks? Okay, so Alexander's got his funny taco story here. So I was at the firehouse. We had tacos for dinner. Uh, at fi uh, five minutes into a call, doing my way, I had to... <laughs> he had a fart. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Sometimes we hit a bump and I push my radio and you fart it and everybody on the radio heard it? That is very awkward. Okay, so he had a radio on his side at the firehouse. He had a fart. Somebody bumped into him. He, push, he pushes the, uh, the talk button on the radio. And I guess everybody on the radio heard the fart. That's definitely a crazy story, brother. Definitely pretty wild. That will probably never happen again. What a coincidence. Yeah, you're a bro. You can hear you. Even when she's screaming. Oh, she's loud. It's off inside. Usually I'm always inside, but Sarah's in here, so I wanted to do the outside view for you guys. Me and Sarah are fighting. Yeah. She's, she's texting Ryan. She's been texting Ryan McGee lately, so. Walter says loud and clear there, driver. That's a big old tan floor. Yeah, that's a big old tan The truck's loud, says Drew. Yeah, loud and proud. As long as the jakes are super loud. Alright, let's get some power on the hill. Come on, baby. Come on, Betsy. Can she do it? Nothing. Stop. We got it. Let's try your method. Code 4. Done. Done with the jake break. Now, in real life, you're spinning the tires that you're digging yourself a hole, so you want to slow it down a little bit. Try to get some traction. But that's not going to work. We're sliding. Yeah, that's a big old team. Pull the brake. Ow. Get block on. There was some power. Drop the brake. Come on, Betsy, you can do it. Come on, baby. You know what I wish that the game actually had the detail 
of actually kicking the dirt up behind you. How dope would that be? Uh, <laughs> Nick? TMI, dude. TMI on that one. The windows are down, too. Yeah, the windows are, are down. Usually, I always have them down to make it loud. I'm actually going to go ahead and get up this hill, surprisingly enough. Uh, she has been texting me too, says Ken. Uh-oh. All right, well then, I'm staying out. I'm doing the outside views of the truck then. I'm not talking to her anymore. We're fighting. I got it. Wow. There's some GGs in the chat for that one. GGs for that one. All right, I'm going to take the dip lock off. Let me put it in neutral. Dip locks off. We're good. Uh, Alexander says, Rich Street, thanks for understanding me. Yeah, I, I, I got it. I got it. I kind of figured, I kind of put two and two together. And I heard you talk about a radio, and I'm like, okay, you probably put part into the radio. Yeah, thanks for the GGs over there. Dustin, Lasher, Amber Mead, Raymond Ceiling. Nick says, try reversing up it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think that's going to work. I mean, that is my favorite thing to do, but I don't think that's going to work. Oh, we're not getting up this one. This one's just too, no, no way. Full break. Not happening. Not even trying it. Look at the grade. What was that? Does anybody hear those sounds? What kind of animal would you say that is? A coyote? Let me shut up for a little bit. You hear that? A coyote, guys? Or what is it? Bigfoot? Uh, Jeff David's got the GGs over there. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate that. Dominic over there. Heather with the GGs. Sarah with the GGs as well. Donald Salone, dude. What's going on, dude? Nice to see you, man. Thanks for coming in. I always see your comments when the stream's over. Always when the stream's over. But I appreciate when you are here. This is the second time I was actually able to catch you live in one of my streams. Oh my god, I'm not gonna I'm gonna slide. We're gonna slide, we're gonna slide, we're gonna slide, we're sliding, we're sliding. Sliding, sliding, jack knife! Jack knife! We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Dude, I'm drifting around those corners like a bad out of H double hockey sticks. Let's go. Oh my god, speed bump! That was a wild speed bump right there. A little bit wild. All right, now I have a feeling that the spiders are going to come back. Jarvis says, what's up, Mercer? Oh, yeah, Jarvis is another one that always comes when my streams are over. Jarvis, thanks for coming in. I'm doing well. The reason that that just happened right there, guys, is there's divots in the road right there. And my truck caught the bumper right there in the divot, and it went through their truck. Look at that ram. He just goes through there like there ain't nobody's business. Come on, dude, let's go following this ram. I'm going to hop in your bed, dude. Not literally. I'm not going to hop in that dude's bed, guys. I'm going to hop in his truck bed, okay? Uh, Joe says, I thought that was a whale. Was that a whale sound? I'm going to put myself here. I really don't like these roads with the rocks. I'm not a fan of this. So much for this. Oh, look at that guy over there. <laughs> He's probably looking at me thinking the same thing. Look at that guy over there. Alexander says, LOL, let it whip. Yeah, look at our whips up at the front. It's pretty dope. Love the whips with all the bumps, too. Oh my god, dude, he came out of there 100 mile an hour. All right, uh, let's go ahead and stop right here. And we'll go ahead and keep going straight. Petrie Rich, uh, Russell says, LMAO, Jordan, Dustin Hacker. Look at all the shack. My day could be worse. It's actually still inside of his truck. I don't know if you can see him over there. But he is stuck. That guy that guy deserves a shack in his second. Drew Martinez says, Rich Street the Drifter over there. Who sings that song? Drifter. So the classic rock song. The Midnight Rider? Uh, Dawn over there. You hear the birds over there, Dawn? Dawn, I know. They're actually super loud on my side over here, too. I wasn't sure if you guys could hear it before, but now I know it's definitely the birds. The whale sound was the weirdest one so far. Uh, yeah, you could be that guy. Yeah, imagine him. Imagine living out here with no road. Yeah, I would, uh... This guy's just enjoying himself up here. I don't know if you can see him, but... He's just having a blast up there. Just enjoying life, bro. That's the way to do it. Keep an eye out for a T-Rex. I think spiders be the least of your problems. Yeah, there goes another uh, prop duster. This is actually pretty cool. Two guys fishing over there. Looks like you get rid of the 
the sound effects of the crashing noises. Of course, there's going to be a lot of hitting stuff over here. Uh, sounded like a freaking dinosaur. <laughs> Maybe we'll run. We'll run into one. There's an alligator right here. A crocodile, I mean. It's actually bigger than a crocodile, I think, isn't it? That's like prehistoric. That's crazy. Uh, nice trucking, says Walter. Doubt it. Definitely not try nice trucking over here today. I'm crashing a lot. I like how the antenna whips through there. I know, isn't that pretty cool? In real life, those would not be attached to the glass like that. I was telling you guys that before. I, I was, when I was debating when I was making the truck to go ahead and actually keep them like that, I'm like, who's going to go ahead and say that would never be realistic? But nobody actually said it. Everybody loves it. So cool. Uh, that sound kind of did sound like a dinosaur. Now that you say it, I was thinking a coyote. Now that you say dinosaur, it sounds a little bit more realistic. Part dinosaur. Part dinosaur, part Bigfoot. All right, this is this is like a ridiculous part of the map here. Ah, uh, okay. This kind of looks like the same exact thing from before. Am I going the right way? I'm 13 miles out. Yeah, dude, I'm not driving on this portion right here. Do that. Not happening. Let's put ourselves up here. That sucks. That's just horrible. Angels here in the chat. There, Toby says that's a Lake Placid crocodile. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. Huge, dude, huge. Raise the airbag. I don't I don't think I can. They're already raised. They're already raised. Yeah, they're already up. That's as far as they could. I didn't even mess with them on this truck. I tried to make it as high as I could. Guys, I wasn't high while I made the truck. I tried to make the truck as high as I possibly could. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I don't like the receivers on the one. You don't like it, Sean? Okay. I'll try not to put them up there next time. I just thought they were cool how they're, they're whipping around. There was nowhere else I could have put them. Had I been able to put them on the mirror facing forward, I would have. Modern trucking down a Roman path. Yeah. <laughs> this does remind you of a Roman road, doesn't it? Yeah, like a brick road out here. Covered in grass. All right. Yeah. The road. They can do away with this portion of the road here. Do away with the mud there, I could do away with that. Oop. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get around here. I don't need that. Okay, let's put ourselves right here on the dirt. I'm trying to see some more spiders and stuff like that. Some wild and crazy stuff. Oh, he was high. <laughs> All right, David. That's why I put them on the window like that. What's up, Bruce Street says, uh, Stativa. What's up, Stativa? How you doing over there? Hopefully you're well. This looks very, very familiar. If there's a construction zone up here, hold on a second. Yeah. Accident. Um, it would just splinter the windows in a minute. Yeah, I know, Sean. I was actually talking about that before I think you, before you came in. I was telling everybody. Literally, once they whipped once, the window would be spider webbed and broken. It would fall right out. I don't know if you guys know how heavy those antennas are, but they're actually pretty darn heavy. They don't look heavy because they're whipping around, but they're actually heavy. Dude, what's in the middle of the road right now? A rock. I hit a rock. Uh, Jordan, David Conley, Petrie, Rich, Lasher says the guy on the roof was, oh, the guy, oh, the guy on the roof, okay. I think he was just destroying himself. I mean, it didn't look like they really had anything to do in that town. It kind of looked like uh, they didn't have, like, cable or, or modern. Uh, so dancing on your roof was probably the only thing you could have fun doing. Probably listening to, like, a uh, radio channel that was full of static. Because it doesn't look like there's anywhere out here that broadcasts any radio stations. All right, let's, uh, do, 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 do. let's come up here. See if I could uh, flash time real quick. Looks like it's getting dark over here. That still looks dark. Ah, forget. That's fine. Still looks a little dark. The sun was out before. 
Give them to the Devil's Lettuce. That's right. Alexander says rock and roll. Dustin Hacker's in the chat there. Joshua Grendel says, hey, Rich Stream, uh, how are you doing today and how was your birthday? Oh, it was great, man. It was great. Apart from probably having salmonella tomorrow, um, great. <laughs> Thanks for asking, though, dude. Nah, I, I, it doesn't really matter. I'm at, I'm at an age right now where birthdays not even at a good year to celebrate anything. No, nothing iconic. So, it's a normal day. Uh, he was out wicked out of his mind. Yeah, he was. In order to take a look at his points over there. If you guys are watching the stream, make sure you didn't drop a like on the stream. Sorry I don't have any animations over here today. God, come on. I can do away with this traffic. If it was just me on the road, it'd be a lot more enjoyable. Uh, happy belated, says Sativa. Thank you, Sativa. I appreciate that. Dennis with the bada bing bada boom. We haven't had that bada bing bada boom one in there in quite a while. Kind of happy I went with this small little pup trailer over here, though. Little baby. Little baby 30 footer. Oh! Over there, losing, dude. What are we at? We're probably at about 40 shacks in it so far. I said 100 before the stream's over, guys. If I can get another 60 of them in the next 10 miles, then we will have 100. Could you make it where you're just on the road? No. The only thing I could do is I could I could make traffic slow down, so I could make it there have less people on the road, and I already have it like that. There's only one or two trucks coming down. When I first started the stream, there was probably 100 trucks coming down the opposite way of the road. It was insane. Now there's just one or two coming down. Oh, my God. Where's the road at? I can't even see it anymore. All right. We've got a mess coming up here. We're going off road again here, it looks like. I saw another truck bouncing around. Oh, yeah. What do you think she's thinking right now? Look at that guy blowing past me. He's probably like, why did I get in the truck with this dude over here? What was I thinking? Uh, what's the biggest trailer you can haul? In America? In America, one single one is a 53. Some states allow you to go ahead and um, do doubles and triples, which those are 30 foot each. So I know Utah allows it. Not really too sure what other states because I used to live out in Utah. I don't really know. No, we're over here on the East Coast. Uh, Ohio would probably be the farthest east that they have triples. Yeah, I-80 in Ohio. Once you cross from Pennsylvania to Ohio, go to a cannon station to hook up triples. That'd be 30, 60, 90. There's another guy that's crashed over there. It's like deja vu. I feel like I'm freaking out over here. There's more pumpkins over there. I feel like I'm seeing the same stuff over and over again. Uh, uh, she is thinking they need to make better roads out here. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking the same exact thing as she. GMC struggling as well. He has no license plates. Stuck. Stuck. All right, I'm up here in a little bit more. Uh, they've got 57 in Texas. Really? Okay, I guess they got 57s in Texas. I have never heard of that before. I thought 53 was a, a federal thing over here. I know in Canada they have 70s. Canada lets them call 70 foot trailers. And they allow B trades out there too. So they, I believe it's a 70 plus uh, a 40 on the back, or a 40 or a 30, I'm not sure. Uh, Walmart got those 60s out there. Not sure what state they're allowed in. Okay. Definitely not over here. I know they're not allowed over here. No Pennsylvania, no New York, New Jersey. Probably nowhere up until Maine. It's those big states that are wide open. Wyoming, Utah, probably Montana, Dakota. You know, the, the states that nobody lives in. All right, there's a croc right there. Crocking. Highway 57, Highway 57, Heavenly, Texas, come on. Ellis, come on now, let's go, buddy. Big old camp out. 
made this truck so nice and fancy. I put these nice lug covers on here. We smashed it all up today. Stain your trucks all over there, bro. Uh, do you use drive? No, we don't have stain yet. We don't have mans. Even though I, we do have Volvos. You guys have Volvos over there. We, uh, we do have Volvos. I think those are the only ones that you have over there. Unless you go over to Australia, I believe they have tens over there. Ten works. Uh, 353s and across the prairies they can do three of them. Holy moly, I didn't know that, Jeff. I did not know that. That's crazy. Uh, why are AL and animals so big? Oh, dude, wait till you see. You have, have you seen the spiders yet? Uh-oh. Bill. Oh, we saved it. You have not seen the spiders over here yet. Wait till you see it. Hold on a second. Stay tuned. Hopefully we find another one. We have 10 miles left to go. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm getting so aggravated with this road. I cannot get a bumper that's smaller than that. And I keep just bottoming out all the time. All right, look at that thing right there. God! There's a the croc right there. All right, cool. All right, there's cows over there. Those cows would be gone by that spider. The spider would eat all those cows. Oh, you live in San Antonio? Oh, okay. Yeah, we got a lot of Texas in the chat. I'm a long... Oh, you're a long hauler as well, Jeff. Okay, well, there you go. Where are you at right now? Are you on the road right now? No, Bill's out there right now. Uh, Lasher's got the rad. Oh, dude, I'm getting pissed off. All right. We're not, we're not driving on this bumpy road. It's just, oh, there we go. There's a spider for you there, Melissa. Here, let, let me actually tell you here. Oh, there he comes. There he comes. Here comes the spider. Australian style Kenworth truck because they're actually higher up in the air. Dude, look at the spider. He actually pushed the seal. <laughs> How cool is that? How far is your destination? Uh, nine, nine real miles. Nine realistic miles. So nine minutes away if I go 60 miles an hour, which is not going to happen. Tim Mason says, hey. Hey, Tim Mason. How are you doing today? No spider, says Melissa. Hopefully there's another one. Now, at least this road's not bumpy, so I won't bottom out. Yeah, if I get an Australian style, like a T990, or a T909, I could go ahead and probably do these roads a lot better. But I'm using an American style truck over here today. Uh, run it over. Unfortunately, they're more powerful than the truck. Spiders are actually more powerful. Uh, that's a big spider, says Sarah. A huge spider. Sorry, you might want to go ahead and look down in your basement. I think uh, somebody told me in the chat that there's one of them down there. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Creep you out if you're afraid of spiders, right? Uh, Adam Nunnery's in the chat there claimed this point. Trevor Joe saying hello to us. What it do? Guys, make sure you did claim your point for the stream. Exclamation point. Yeah. Uh, we have good trucks here. Yeah. Yeah. Our, our trucks are not meant for this. We drive on roads over here in America. Yeah, th this is not a road. A lot of traffic, though, I'll tell you that. All right. Technically, that's supposed to be mud. Doesn't really look like mud. Doesn't make any splash effects. Kind of boring. Uh, Nick's over there with the rock on things. The Kiva says, uh, what's a good company? KLLM. I have never heard anything bad about KLLM. The only companies I would steer away from would be, eh, I would actually say, I was going to say Warner. Warner's actually pretty good. Uh, uh, Crete? No, not Crete. Uh, 
crest. Crest. The gold with the crest. Swift. Uh, CR England, definitely. I think CR England is the worst. I think they pay their drivers the least amount. And I think when you're in training with them, I think they moved it up to three people in a truck at a time. So when you're in training, you usually have to go ahead and go over the road and you're here with like a guy for like 30 days, two weeks, whatever the company wants. Do you come back and do your road test? Well, usually it's just you and him. So it ain't too bad. One of you is driving and one of you is sleeping all the time. So you guys, you know, interact every once in a while for dinner and stuff, yada, yada. Well, I think CR England went to three drivers per truck or maybe even four. I don't, I don't know. Somebody had told me that a while ago. I'm like, no shit. Are you in the Caribbean or something? No, this is New Hampshire. This is the New Hampshire Roads mod. Now I understand why it takes you so long to get to work, Melissa. Swift, yes, Swift. I mean, I can't really knock Swift too bad. If Swift's on a, if you're on a dedicated account, you might be able to go ahead and now work with it. Because I actually did work for JB. JB hunts another company for rookies. But if you're on a dedicated account, which I was, they're actually pretty decent. Uh, Jeremy Toll says good evening, wrist stream. Good evening, Jeremy Toll. Blow up the wrist stream like button. I see, I see all those uh, reactions coming through. I appreciate that. Whoever is spamming that uh, big old finger over there in the stream, thank you for doing that. If you guys can go ahead and tap it a couple times while you're watching, I appreciate that. I can see those come up over there. It's pretty cool. Seriously, says Melissa. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Sean says a Volvo. Okay. Scott in the chat there. Douglas Lane says Swift is the worst. I think Creed's probably the worst. Yes. I don't know. And Tomata, honestly. Not Creed. I keep saying Creed. Uh, Crest. Uh, Schneider. Ah, eh, Schneider ain't too bad. Schneider ain't too bad. If you're on a date, they have a lot of dedicated accounts as well. So does Warner. So does Warner. I don't know. I don't know. I never drove any of them over the road, but there's companies. But if you got like a local job in your area with a day cab, you got like Schneider running it or JB, you could definitely make a living doing that. Sean says uh, these buildings are nice as the bridges and the roads. I don't mind the map at all. My only downfall is the struck and the, rip, the divots in the road. So I'm going to try it next time I do this with a jacked up Kenworth. Like I told you guys before. I think that's the only way I'm going to be able to do it. Because I have to keep cheating. So we're going to have to put like 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 5,000, 10,000 horsepower. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. We're going underwater? Yo. That's cool. Hey, Greg. Look at the sharks over there. There's sharks. Oh my god, a Megalodon! Or, or what is that? What would you guys say that is? Is that a... Not, that's not a shark. What is that? Prehistoric, dude. Where are we? <laughs> is he gonna eat the fish? I guess he's not hungry. He's, he didn't eat the fish. Trippy. Yeah, that is trippy. Race miles. Yeah, most likely. I, thought, I got I got race miles on my first one. Shorty was yelling at me. Russell Brock says, what the heck? That's a tuna right there, I think. That's a tuna, right? I, I hate tuna, guys. I hate tuna. I had, there's a shark right there. I ate tuna one time in my life, and I immediately ran to the garbage pit and threw up. And I wasn't even at, uh, I wasn't at home. I was at a summer camp when I was a kid. And that was what was on the menu that day. I was hungry. So I took a bite of it. I saw everybody else putting hot sauce all over it. Loaded with hot sauce, put it in my mouth, dude. Immediately ran over the garbage can and started yakking. Great stork, that's right. It's a crocket. It's a crocodile. That's pretty cool. Never seen anything like that before. Literally a dinosaur. Yeah, that looks prehistoric. There's one right there. Oh my god, that was bigger. That one looks like it just ate like 70 sharks. 70 sharks inside that. What is that, dude? That is so weird. <laughs> it's doing circles. What is that, dude? That's so trippy. Let me get my lights on. It's a fish? Yeah, it's a fish. Technology to build that tunnel, but I can't fix a road. <laughs> That's legit, yo. 
the roads are horrible out here, but they built this tunnel. <laughs> yeah, that's right. This is actually pretty cool. Let's go inside. I can't really see as much as on the inside. I'm all over the road. I'm glad that there's no oncoming traffic. Oh, there's another one right there. Prehistoric. There's a little shark. He says a little shark. Well, it looks little to that compared to that thing. Oh, I'm gonna crash. Save it, save it, save it, save it, save it. Saved it. Uh, as Steve Irwin would say, it's Crockett. It's Crockett. I think that's how you're trying to say it over there, Jordan. I don't think you'll be able to spell it like that. Crikey. Or, or no, he says crikey, doesn't he? Crikey. Uh, Monsterosaurus. Oh my god, look at the size of that one. Whoa! Maybe that's the same size as... No, that one's bigger. Dude, that's the size of a shopping mall. <laughs> that's crazy. I wonder if there was actually dinosaurs that big in real life. Like, underneath the water. How weird. Now, I'm gonna be in the first human... No, humans were Tuna doesn't go with beer, Ken says. No, tuna doesn't go with anything, dude. It's disgusting. Up to me. I know a lot of people do like it. This is a Jurassic map, says Sean. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. It's not called Jurassic. Uh, Chikey. Chikey. Bro, I thought it was Crikey. Is it Chikey? I think that was wrong. Steve Irwin's been gone for how long now, guys? Quite a long time. Been 10 years so far? I like dinosaurs pre-date mag magazine. I don't, really, uh, I don't really know too much about dinosaurs, not going to lie to you. Just what I learned in high school. Never really got into it. Watch Jurassic Park. Actually just watched it uh, a couple months ago, not gonna lie. First one. It was on TV. Uh, Sean says, yeah, purple. They're coming for the colas over there. Dude, look how big that is. That, that, it's it's kind of silly. It's so fat. Like, like, what, what is it eating? The ocean would be empty if that thing was full. Come on, dude, let's go. Scotty, because I was told that crocodiles are the only species, species left of dinosaurs. I think, I think, like, uh, turtles, uh, lizards. Aren't all those somewhat prehistoric? I don't really know. Crocodiles, definitely alligators. Because I guess when the big boom came or whatever, they were already underwater, so they survived. Right? But why aren't any of the other uh, water species still alive that the crocodiles were able to survive? I don't know. I'm not going to get wild with it. That's too much for me to think about. Uh, the Loch Ness Monster. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw that next. Oh, no. Back her down, dude. Back her down, back her down, back her down. Happy birthday, Rissa. Hey, Tom. Thanks, you, brother. Appreciate that, man. You just getting up right now, man? Probably just getting up to go ahead and start the grind over there. Thanks for thanks for the the, the birthday wishes, brother. I appreciate that. Hopefully you're having a good day. The circles he was saying hello, Rich. That's all. The circles he was saying hello to you, Richard. Oh, okay. He he, he rolls over. He wants me to pet his belly. Spinosaurus. Spinosaurus. Crocs ate everything else. So you're telling me the crocodiles ate one of those huge things that are in the water over there? Might be Sandy and Spongebob. Alright, dude. I might have to rub my eyes a little bit if I see Sandy and Spongebob over here. Then I know I'm getting a little tired. Petrie Rich has happy birthday. Thank you, Petrie. I looked up to see if there was a fish in prehistoric cards that was... 5 meters long and 45 metric tons. I don't know the metric system. How uh, how long is that in uh, in our system over here? I don't know anything about Celsius or anything in metric millimeters, anything like that. Apologize. Apologize for my ignorance. Uh, yeah, I'm just waking up. Have a great stream. Hey, Tom. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. We're just looking at dinosaurs over here on this back road. I'm going to get around. Should I pass these guys? I don't have time for this. Oh, we're only two miles out. Let's enjoy the scenery. 
this is our last look. Uh, I don't know, says Russell Brock. Me neither. I don't know the metric system. This is the longest tunnel. I know. It was funny of you guys saying that before, that they, uh, they can't build the road, but they could build this tunnel. Instead of a bridge. I think a bridge might have saved them a couple million dollars, maybe a billion dollars. All right, I'm passing these guys. I don't have this. It's a lot of the same stuff over and over and over again here. Uh, there's a missing a dolphin. I don't. I didn't see a dolphin. I see sharks. Definitely don't see a dolphin yet. Speaking of the dolphins, how'd that Dolphins Eagle preseason game go? Shaxidents? No. Oh, Shaxidents have not counted since the beginning of the stream. We're gonna flip. We got it. Saved it. Shaxidents. I told you guys they don't count at the beginning of the stream. That's. I'm actually an automatic right now. Yeah, it's the first time you guys have ever seen me run an automatic truck. It'd be way too hard for me to shift down these hills. Tom Ellis claiming his point while he wakes up. Big old kid for Tom. Uh, the roads are better. Yeah, the roads are a lot better in the tunnel. They are a lot better. All right, we'll try to go ahead and get around the Home Depot. Uh, two hours and two minutes. Yeah, <laughs> super fun stream today. Not a tunnel, somebody says in the chat. Gordy McGregor says it's not a tunnel. What would you call it? A tube? It, 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 I think it's a tunnel. That's supposed to be water over there. Oh, come on. He's cutting me off. He doesn't want me to pass him. Oh, imagine if I broke the glass. Oh, dude, I'm not going to be able to make this hill. That's a freaking Home Depot. Get our blinker on. We get in front of Home Depot. See if I go ahead and get up this hill. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. Oh, dude, no way. Look how steep that is. Not happening, dude. No, I don't think that's going to happen. Come on, baby. Maybe I proved myself. Oh. Maybe I proved myself wrong. Not good for the Eagles. <laughs> we're lucky it doesn't count, right? Oh, you know what? Actually, I, th I think I did ask somebody that on Sunday. I think we got blown out. Uh, but what do you mean by not a tunnel? Kobe Stroud says you got this. My American flag right there. Come on, baby. You can do it. I got my blinker on over here. Uh oh. We're starting to lug out. Your headlights on. Uh oh. Oh, Home Depot. Look at him. He's gonna pass me. Oh, it must be nice. It must be nice to have a powerful engine over there, Home Depot. He's probably got the 1,000 horsepower. I'm, I'm over here struggling with 500. Come on, Kevin. Woo, woo. We're, we're coming along. I'm embarrassed right now. There's an international. Passing out. A big old Pete over here. That's embarrassing. I'm not going to tell anybody in the yard about that one. I'm keeping that one to myself. No, nope, this guy. Oh, we're finally out of the tunnel. Yeah. Or what was it? Because if that was supposed to be water, then where does the water go? It's like the water's trapped in there. Like they purposely made that. I don't know. I can't think about things too much. It'll hurt my brain. Uh, he's going to beat you up to the top, says Douglas Lane. Yeah, he probably is. Make sure... What? <laughs> Drew. <laughs> Hey, look at the beautiful skies over here. How awesome does that look? Let's go inside the truck and look at it. Just look at it, dude. Could you just look at that? That's pretty. Now, this is the road I like. Something like this the whole time. Uh, they can rewatch. Yes, they'll have to. They'll have to. The Pro Star passed the peak. That's embarrassing. Yeah, don't tell anybody I work with about that one. Make fun of me. Oh, we're almost there. It's about 54 feet long and 100,000 pounds. Was the biggest fish ever, apparently. Gone. That's insane, brother. Insane, dude. Long as a tractor trailer, 100,000 pounds. So as, as heavy as like an oversized load. Uh, I think it was like 4, 4210. 
42 10 was a score for okay. Where are we going? Turn right. I passed it. Okay, no, I didn't pass it. Turn right. Guys, crossing the road here. I'm gonna have to run him over. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Watch my off track. But he's walking right into me. Is he invisible? Oh, he's invisible. That was that guy. This guy's also invisible. I'm gonna run him all over. Move! Let's get her. Oh! Turn left. All right, we're gonna turn left. Oh, this is pretty cool. Look at this. I thought we were there, but we're not there yet. We're apparently delivering right up there where all those containers are. I think. Yeah, look at my map. Yep. Oh, that's beautiful scenery. Yeah, it is. I love the scenery, says Jordan as well. Yeah, the scenery is beautiful. This, the clouds look amazing. This, I just, oh crap, we're gonna flip over. I didn't even realize that there was some a, a dirt mound on the road right there. Why is your contrast always so high? That's just the way I like it. The way I like it. Barbecue chicken alert. Barbecue chicken alert. Do you not like it that high? Alright, where's the jokes at in the chat? Do you not like getting that high? Alright. Ah, uh, oh, dude. They couldn't have given me an easier back than that? It's the easiest one ever. Easy, easy, Japanese, easy. Put it in reverse and throw her in the hole. Doesn't get any easier than that, Restream. With a little baby trailer. There we go. We're inside the green. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put it in neutral. Uh, we'll go ahead and pull our brakes out. We'll hop inside, we'll shut our engine down. And you guys in the chat will go ahead and let me some big old fingers on time. Late for class stickers for late for delivery over there. Fire, fire, fire. You guys think I should do this again? Uh, drop me some, uh, bada, uh, let's, let's drop the, uh, bada bang, bada boom sticker if you guys ever want me to do this again. If I do, it'll be late at night like this. So, one of the nights over there. Maybe like a Sunday or something. Uh, <laughs> you could get higher, says David Villa. Lasher Splasher says on time. Russell says on time. Brad says on time. Petrie Rich, Jordy McGregor, Toby Stroud, Don. Guys, usually our loads are always late. But our first load of the stream over there was actually on time somehow. So this new map, I, I'm somehow able to get on time. All right, David Bill wants to see us do it again. Uh, Jordan, Jeremy, Don, Petrie Rich, Russell Brock over there. Okay, so six people over there. Not everybody, but big old tan board. David Connolly says on time. Let's see, Toby Stroud. Okay, we got a couple late for classes as well. David Villa, Jeremy yes. Hartman. Uh, who else we got with the late for class? Only two late for classes over there. Everybody's got confidence on wrist stream tonight. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let me make sure that's all of you. Do, 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 do. Bill Cook says on time. Uh, but, but, but TJ Carpenter and Dominic say on time. Don, Petrie, and Russell say they want to go ahead and see the stream again. All right, guys, let's go ahead and drop our landing gear down here. Beautiful. And we're going to go ahead and uh, get our airlines off quickly. And somehow, guys, somehow, we have got around the rainbow there. And we uh, got another one on time. Two on times today. Two on times today. And what? 14 late for classes during the weekend over there. Raymond Sealing, Sarah Cloder over there saying on time. DJ Carpenter, Dominic on time, Bill Cook on time. Everybody, we were on time on that one. So, whenever I play this map again, remember guys, we're always going to be on time. I guess there is no late for classes over here for this one. There's no late for classes. Kind of explore over here, guys. I'm going to ask you to do me a favor. I don't have any fun little animations over here for you guys to look at. So, I'm just going to ask you guys to drop me some GGs in the chat. GGs, Ristream. Ristream, what does GG mean? What does that even mean, brother? It means good game. It's good game. Let's see. Where do you go from here? I, I, I kind of wanted to explore. Oh, so next time, we're going to be going up a railroad track here. Okay. I'm giving you guys a little sneak peek. All right. We got Jesus over there. Uh, Heather Stewart, Petrie Rich, uh, John, <laughs> Drew, Kevin, Douglas Lane over there. Oh, my goodness gracious. Great balls of fire. That's pretty dope. Look at that. What? That's a Viper, isn't it? That's a Viper when they have that thing like that. Is that, is that a Viper, guys? Am I right on that one? Benny with the GG's. Petrie with the GG's. Michael Chaston with the GG's. Joe with the GG's. David Villa with the GG's. Norm says, I wanted to hop back on and say happy birthday once again. Norm, thank you, man. Definitely appreciate that very much. Is that a Viper, guys? Appreciate that, Norm. Uh, David Villa with the GG's. Jordan McGregor and Adam Nunnery with the big old finger. It's a, oh, a Cobra. A Cobra. Okay. Cobra. Okay, that's cool. 
Let's come down here. Oh my god, this is gonna be horrible next time. Oh, we gotta make sure that we use a better truck. More powerful engine, better truck. Got a cowboy over here just enjoying himself. That's a cobra. It's a king cobra. All right. Do vipers have that those things that stick out as well? I don't know why I was thinking of viper. Viper used to be my favorite car, a Dodge Viper when I was a kid. I always dreamed of having one. And then when I grew up, I'm like, I don't want one anymore. I mean, I guess if someone gave them to me, I wouldn't have it, but... Uh, it's a Cobra. Uh, Nick Britton with the GG says, Good night, Ristream. Good night, Nick Britton. Thanks for coming in saying hello to us. I don't look like there's much over here. Just train tracks we're going to travel. This map goes on forever, dude. You can do this. Ah, uh, yeah, see, I would, I would be struggling right here. But if we stayed on the pavement, or the... The, uh, these are rocks. These are rocks. I mean, if we stayed on the rocks, we'd be able to go ahead and get up here, most likely. 1,000 horsepower we gotta do. 1,000 or 10,000? Alright, guys. Well, thanks for coming in. I will see you guys tomorrow. Everybody have a good night. Until next time, guys. We signing out of here. GG's. Bada bing, bada booms. Norm Lasher. Russell says, I think the Viper has a class of snakes. I think Viper is a class of snakes with fangs. Okay. You have to teach me some snake stuff over here. Uh, bada bing, bada boom, sticker's not working, Jordy McGregor. Well, I literally just uploaded it right before the stream started, so maybe you're on one of those apps that don't load quickly. Some people are having that problem where they have to uninstall, reinstall. I don't know why, but big old tan for guys. Thanks for coming in. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Kevin says, peace out, Houston, Texas. David Villa, Scotty, John Briggs, Jordan Spencer, Toby Stroud with the GGs. Brandon says, take it easy. Lemon squeezy, dude. Uh, Sarah says happy birthday once again with the heart over there. Thank you, Sarah. I appreciate that. Toby says good night, bro. Have a good one. Toby, thanks for watching the whole stream. Those of you guys who were here the whole entire stream, Brad, Toby, uh, a bunch of you guys in the chat there. Jordy McGregor, one of our first comments over there. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. That's fire. You definitely don't have to do that, but thank you for doing it. Uh, John Briggs, Seth, Brandon says, do you have any pictures of your setup? And I, right here, dude. Right here. Steering wheel, shifter, button box. And we just got a bunch of computer stuff behind you over here. Monitors and lights. Uh, Garth says good morning. Erwin, good morning, brother. We actually are just finishing up over here. We were running a uh, Peterbilt 386 today. Didn't go so well. Didn't go so well. David Villa, Drew says good night. If you're going to sleep, I am headed to bed right now. Maybe not. I don't know. I was drinking a little bit of Red Bull, so I might not have a. Might, I might not be able to go ahead and fall asleep. Might have to go ahead and work on our stuff for tomorrow. Uh, make sure <laughs> a surprise stream, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for all the happy birthdays, guys. I'll see you guys on the next one. Melissa Torres. Thanks for the GG. Peace out. Bada bang. Bada boom. Seth says bye bye. See you later, Seth. I haven't seen you in a hot minute. Seth actually has a bus thing. Uh, John says goodnight, sir. John, thanks for all the facts over there about the largest fish. Appreciate that. And thanks for calculating the metric system to our system over here. Joe, thanks for the 75. John Briggs says, thanks. I missed the stream. John, what time is it right now? John. 11 o'clock your time. Let's go. Time for bed. Peachtree Tree Rich Norm says hit the horn one time for the one time. All right. One time for the one times. Okay. Here we go. There you go. Bada bang, bada boom. Peachtree Tree Rich Norm says hit the horn. We got you over there. Sean. Night, buddy. Thank you, Sean. I'll try not to put the, uh, try not to put the whips on the, uh, on the front again next time. Try not to. That one actually looks like it's in a decent spot, but they would have had to drill a huge hole in the window right there. And since they do flex, they would have had to put like some sort of a rubber around it because had it hit the glass, it would have definitely broke. All right, enough fun facts over there, guys. We got to go. David Bill with the Taco Tuesday. David and everybody, hopefully you guys have a fun Taco Tuesday. I will see you tomorrow with Salmonella Poisoning. Until next time, peace out. Bada bang, bada boom. Uh, Twigger's on right now. He's a pretty cool dude. Go ahead and say hello to Twigger. He's rocking the rolling 389. Peace out. Boom. I'm waiting to get in trouble now. Well, crap, guys. Rich just uh, sent us a ride, so I guess we're going to do another load. Let me see what we got going on here. Oh, you didn't do nothing, brother.